Doo -doo vlog, bitches. What's up, guys? You guys really liked my vlog last week, so here we are. Here we are. Well, it wasn't even last week. It was like two weeks ago, girl. Today is Monday, and I have a lot to do. I have to write another essay on Nazi Germany, but it's a free topic, so I get to choose what I want. And I think I'm going to write about cross-dressing Nazis because homophobia, but y'all were cross-dressing. Then I'm going to make myself some curry for dinner, like a simple, quick curry, onions, peppers, tofu, the works. Um, sorry, I'm not really doing much today. Look at my hair, it's a mess. I'm wearing pajama pants, like, I'm just not feeling it today, but I wanted to say hey, so, hey. Do do vlog, bitches. I know I look crazy, hold on. <laughs> stop smoking dope, you can get- You need to stop smoking dope, let me stop. So, I did three, and I'm not gonna lie. Triceratops. I need to do my eyebrows so I don't look as crazy. I'm about to film this freaking antebellum commentary slash review. I already know some people are gonna be a little upset because all I've been seeing online is people trashing this. I I'm a, I'm gonna get to it, girl. We're gonna we're gonna get into it, but not on this video. I just wanted to show you guys that I did though. I did just do like some real quick bantu knots. <laughs> all right, so I fucked up. I dropped a cup yesterday here, so you can see me. Not da, 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 da. Crazy. I dropped a cup yesterday and it bust all over the floor. So now I'm wearing flip flops. Bust. I made this vegan pizza. This is freaking Amy's pizza and then I added some of this shit and some like. <laughs> that bitch supreme. <laughs> I just haven't been vlogging. I'm like, Daniel, can you please get my camera? Yeah. I don't know what it's what it is about this week. I don't know if it's because I was sick yesterday or what. That just like threw me off. Oh, you executive produced your first EP, man. You did it good. You done good, Morty. That was good. All right, bake for 12 to 14 minutes. 15 to 13 minutes. 12 to 14. 25 to 35 minutes. 15. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Skirt, 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 skirt. Whoa there, buckaroo. We got no seasoning on this bitch. That bit dry. That bit dry. Okay, we need some onion powder because that's the one thing I didn't feel like chopping up. Nigga, you need to put some garlic on there. Cause I got, before. um, I got the dice shit. So I didn't, I don't have no onions. You said get some garlic? Yes. Battery at 79%, Where's sir. Garlic hey, hey. Where is your shirt? I just, where is I your shirt? The shirt? Oh bro. my God, you know why, get out of the camera. Get out of the camera, you're new. Slut shaming no, me? I'm gonna have to put like a sensor, like. Just, just CGI me a, a sweat. You gotta stay still. <laughs> Doo -doo vlog, bitches. Hey everybody, it is Wednesday. I'm about to go live in like an hour. I have to pick out some tribe teas. Clothes, damn. This is like the best twist out I've had in so long. Like, look at this. Girl, yes. This part is a little stupid, but I'm living for this twist out. So this is the live stream fit, very basic. We've seen her before. I'm about to make some tacos for dinner, so I just got some stuff thawing out. And I'm making myself some like ramen right now before I go live. Ugh, I wish today was freaking Friday. I need a fucking drink, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just been an emotional freaking wreck recently. Like just emotional, emotional, emotional. Emotional, emotional, emotional. I'm about to start my period in a few days, so maybe that's what's going on. Um, I need to pay rent. It's just like so much stuff. Um, I'm gonna have like a sit down and talk with you guys though because I feel like that's like the part of my vlogs that you guys like the most is when I sit down and like get personal. So next time you see me, I'm gonna be getting a little bit more personal, okay? Probably when I'm like, I'm not wearing makeup today though. Whatever, I'm gonna, I was gonna say probably when I'm doing my makeup, but whatever, I will be back with a little bit more update of my life and everything and like you know the reason why y'all nosy asses want to be on this channel anyway okay so i definitely did not do what i said i was going to do earlier <laughs> but um <clears throat> i'm about to start working on editing but before i start editing i'm gonna eat some food oh my god it's so weird like I'm trying my best to vlog and it's like crazy cause like when I don't vlog for a long time I get like this crazy second wind and I just go ham. I'm trying to do better, I'm trying to do better. I hope by like, as the week goes on I get better. I mean it's only Wednesday. So I know it doesn't look all that. I know it looks like a fart but <laughs> we got our beefless ground. Um, you can't see underneath all these vegetables 
Okay, this one's a little bit better to see what I got going on, but I got jalapenos, diced tomatoes, um, beefless ground, uh, fried beans, like mixed different types. It's like different types of beans. And then I put it in the thing. I mash it up, put it in the thing. Y'all know, know what fried beans are. I didn't really eat these until I met Daniel. Like Daniel's mom be using these um, refried bean stuff and like, I never had it before. And then I just, it grew on me. I like it now. So, oh, and then I made um, some Spanish, well, yeah, Spanish rice, I guess. I was gonna say Mexican rice, but I've had actual Mexican rice before and this ain't that. So <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Mexican rice is good. Like I've had it and the color is usually like different. Like it's more so like, I wouldn't say my nails, but it's way more orange like and it tastes really good and it has like little peas and it's so good. I thought that there was a Married to Millions, I mean not Married to Millions, Married at First Sight episode, but I guess there's not. So that sucks, that was a disappointment. I was trying to watch it on the fire stick early, but the fire stick said, girl, try again. Not today, no with a heart. That's what I've been watching uh, Married at First Sight this season. I'm about to go and watch the other seasons too, just because I'm bored. Like, I'm just trying to fill my time with like stupid, quirky, dumb, obviously fake entertainment to take a break from the internet's like, weird political entertainment. Like I'm just tired of being forced to partake in the politics thing. Like I, I know who I'm voting for, like, come on girl, it's too much. Y'all, I love cranberry juice. Like this has always been my shit. Drink cranberry juice y'all, cranberry juice is so good. And some people may be like, oh my God, cranberry juice is so tart, it's so bitter. Get cranberry juice that is not from concentrate. If you get it not from concentrate, it tastes so good. It's like a very mature taste. Like it's very good. And if you're like me and you don't have yogurts and stuff like that on deck. Well, I did buy this yogurt recently, coconut milk yogurts, but I don't think these have probiotics in them, do they? No, they do not. Don't get it twisted. I, I have vitamins and stuff, but I'm just saying like, Ladies, cranberry juice, especially on my vegan folks. But um, yeah, I'm about to eat this freaking food. I'm so hungry. Mukbang, I guess. I don't know what this is. I haven't done the mukbang in so long. My water's all the way over there. My dog is right here, being weird. Can you like give me some space while I'm eating, please? No, 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 no. Go to bed. Oh my God, Daniel's outside skateboarding and stuff. He told me that uh, the neighbor from the last vlog I posted is moving or whatever. U-Haul truck out there, shit. I thought everything was okay, but it makes sense that they're moving because last weekend I went to um, my friend's house and I got home at maybe like 11.30 or so. Maybe like 11.00. 10 11 30 saturday night and they were throwing like a little party at their house and they had the music the speakers was loud and stuff and oh girl and the stud were so drunk that they were making like cat noises and i thought there was a stray cat like near my car look i love animals but when cats urinate under your car no ma'am no ma'am no ma'am um but no, alas, it was not a cat. It was two grown ass, well, one non-binary, because I don't know what to call studs. Studs identify as everything. You got one non-binary person and one girl in the dark, caked up, talking about rare. Or like, what is going on? Y'all need to get in the fucking house. But it makes sense, because if I knew I was moving, sure, this is some juvenile shit to do. Like, But if I was moving, you know, yeah, do a little bon voyage. Mm, I ordered more canvas. A lot of you guys always give me compliments on this, and you know what? It inspired me to paint more. Yeah, I bought three, I think four, really huge canvas. So at some point, I don't know if it's gonna be in this vlog, or the next one, or if I'm gonna give it its own video, um, I'm gonna be painting. I know I'm gonna be using one of the, uh, this twist out girl. Yes, yes, new curls. This is, I'm sorry, this is just the best like Bantu knots twist job type that I've done in a really long time because my other shit was looking a mess. Yeah, I want to do a hyper-realism, uh, not hyper-realism, I want to do a portrait, realism, I want to do a portrait. I'm talking like scaling, graphs, 
I want to make an accurate like portrait for the house. It's going to be for um, the bedroom because our bedroom is very bland. Like our bedroom doesn't have anything going on and Daniel will never be wanting to decorate because he's boring and he's a boy and whatever, I guess, girl. My compromise with that is that I'd overly decorate the office. Well, I could say his compromise is letting me have full reign. He pretty much let me have full reign of the whole house. <laughs> But when it comes to the bedroom, I can respect that. Like, you know, that's the one thing. Like, I can respect that. You get what I'm saying? Like, I pretty much interior designed the whole house. And I did free reign decoration. Even when I did downstairs, I did consider the fact that a male lives here. But in the office, I just went free reign. But he never says no to my artwork. So, tea. Not tea. Cranberry juice. My goodness, I'm getting so full. I have to edit my antebellum video. I hope that shit doesn't get copyrighted. I'm be mad. Like, girl, I'm being transformative. I really do feel like more people should watch it and decipher for themselves how they feel about it. Cause this year has just been all about group thinking and herd mentalities and peer pressure. Like we've literally come to a place in our country. I'm so tired of politics. I'm so tired of it. And this is one of the reasons why. It's just like at this point, you have to be all or nothing with stuff. And I even talked about that shit on Daniel Nat's podcast channel. Like when we went live the other day just to clear the air up. Because people just were so pressed that we had an opinion. And it's just like, bro, it's come to the point where like, if somebody says they're voting for Biden, you're a chomo. If somebody says you're voting for Trump, then they're a Nazi. Like there is no in between anymore. Girl, can Christmas come on? It's come to the point where I don't even care about Halloween. I don't even care about Thanksgiving. Like, quiet as it's kept, people really ain't about to get gifts this year. I'm paying for school out of pocket. Like, nobody buddy, better not look at me for nothing. Let me know in the comments if y'all like that. Like, some people ain't getting shit this year, girl. Some of my presents from last year got returned to sender. And I kept them in my storage. And I'm going to ship them back out through a different carrier. I'm that, yeah, I'm that bitch. I will save a gift for a whole year. No fucks given. But if it makes you feel better, just know that gift, that gift was always meant for you if I saved it for you. Daniel decided to grace me with his present. It feels so good. now. Crazy. I know. Oh it finally God. hit below 70 here. For like two seconds out of every day, it hits like 69. No, it's only 55 tonight. Tonight? Yeah, at least tonight. Mm -hmm. You woke me up in the- I'm not gonna sell out. Hold on, I'm gonna turn the camera off. Hold on. <laughs> Doo -doo vlog, bitches. I am currently editing and trying to eat a popsicle. I'm trying to get this up by uh, tomorrow, actually. I think I'll be able to do it. I really do, because I'm almost like done. It's crazy. What do you want? You want some of my ice cream? Get a life. This shit needs to hurry up and melt a little bit so I can have some. I want some ice cream. Ooh, I'm so sorry. Don't lick my stuff. Ow. I got shotgun. I got shotgun, bitch. I just went outside to walk the dog for two seconds, right? And the neighbor, like, me mugged my ass. I think he might have gotten into an argument with somebody. <laughs> yeah, because I said, hi, how are you? And he just, like, looked at me and me mugged me and then just, like, hopped in his car and immediately reversed. I'm like, okay. Damn. I'm mad my neighbors have turned into my soap opera entertainment. There we go. Do do vlog, bitches. Girl, I think I might be an introvert. <laughs> it's really scary to say out loud, but I really think I might be an introvert. Only because like I like physically, physically feel drained after I hang out with people, girl. Like, cause it's so weird. Like I be wanting to hang out, but all of my friends and associates and family, they all hit me up on the same day. I don't know if I be casting out lines with my energy where it's just like passing out pick me signals to, to people. In my, I don't know if I do that or what, but it's just so eerie that like everybody bombards me at the same time. And like, I think I might be an introvert because I don't mind hanging out with my friends and stuff, but 
I need to recharge. And like when I say recharge, I mean at least a week or two to myself per interaction, not per person. Like I am a FaceTime shoddy for real. Like I, and I, I was blaming on the virus at first, but honestly, Girl, did I even introduce today? Today is Thursday, I don't I don't know. I'm texting somebody right now and they did ask me to hang out and the last time they asked me to hang out, I was at somebody else's house and I was feeling drained. And um, now I'm a little bit more free. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna hit them up and not be a, a booty hole. But let me go, girl. Oh, and my canvases are here. Look how big they are. It's freaking huge. Doo doo vlog, bitches. Yo ex, nigga. You be your friend. Girl, I know this song pissed somebody off, like, just period. But that last part. So I just got back from the liquor store. Girl, what the fuck is new? Just preparing for the weekend. I can't wait until I'm like, uh, actually have like a, a wine cellar or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just walking around my apartment right now. If you guys can't tell, I'm like manic as fuck. I'm about to try on these new pajamas, but obviously I can't show y'all on camera because booty cheeks out, titties out, like, no. Um. But I had a pretty okay day. I got a lot of stuff done. I posted my antebellum video. Um, I FaceTimed with a few friends. Chilled with the dog. I watched Married at first sight. I'm so ready for this season to be over. These couples are pissing me off. The only couples I like are like the hippie couple. Um, I think Woody is fake as fuck. I think... <laughs> Y'all, should I just talk? Should I just sit down and tell y'all how I feel about this show? I don't know. Some people are like, Naja, I want you to do Love After Lockup again. But honestly, they get, they're aggravating too because, and then even the new couples are basically just like great value versions of the old ones. Like it's the same plot line, it's tired. I think some of the plot lines are just flat out fake. I mean, like Angela wasn't even married to bro. Like, I don't know. That show is kind of tiring, but I'm not gonna lie, I'll be watching it. I'll be watching it. I love my trash TV. I don't know why, like for some reason, I won't stoop low enough to watch the Real Housewives of anything, but I'll stoop that low to watch some 90 Day Fiance. <laughs> Doo -doo vlog, bitches. Yo, I hated this song and now it's like my bop. Cheers, Miley, bitch. Yes, bitch. Just reminds me of the weekend. I love it. I was... Bruh, am I about to have one of these days where I just sit down and listen to music? <laughs> no, we gotta get to that Paramore real quick. Are you willing to sacrifice No, ma'am, no, sir. Except Jesus as my Lord and Savior. Uh, Daniel got me some vegan energy drink. This shit's nasty. <laughs> the pears. Shout out to all the pear. It's so disgusting. Oh, no. Doo doo vlog, bitches. Oh, yeah. I'll be right back. We need mouthwash. Mouthwash, saline yeah. solution. Let's go to the tropics. Let's get smoothies let's, first. Let's get smoothies. We're about to run some errands. As always, it's always what we do. And Daniel is off. We run errands. Because I don't like running errands by myself all the time. I like having friends do it with me sometimes too, but I'm off on like really unconventional days. Oh shit, we moving. <laughs> it's my sister's birthday and my brother's birthday. Which one? And their birthdays are a day apart. I was born by the river. Stop walking. I was born by the river. I was shaking that ass. <laughs> it's the glasses mask combo that just makes people look very suspicious. <laughs> you heard that Kanye sample? Yeah, that shit's fire. I'm trying to get like dumb. It's a dumb character, but it's not alcohol though. That's like, you know, old school Listerine, right? What do you think about these? If you like it, I don't think that's gonna do no good. No, though. I know you put them over the ones that you put on your face. Yeah, it's like right that. But they're cute. Hey, nigga, you like that. They'll be so extra. <laughs> <laughs> Next to I used to always see commercials about that shit when I was a kid. What'd you say? They keep oh, they moved it? Oh, okay. Oh, so they don't have smaller ones? Is that just it? 
So it's everything is like the like the standard requirement in Walgreens eight ninety nine. Like everything in here is eight ninety nine. Can you go wrong by doing that though? Like this is eight ninety nine. That's eight ninety nine. That's eight ninety nine. Ew. But this is what you Dude, now we're at freaking Walmart trying to get some more stuff. This vlog probably makes no sense. Why because I've been I've been a bad vlogger this week. This is like my best vlogging day that I've had. Um What is that? Do do vlog bitches. Um I have so much fluff in my hair. I'm about to close this vlog out. I've had a really weird Saturday just driving around doing favors and stuff. Um yeah, I don't know, but I'm gonna close the vlog out because I feel like I haven't. Oh, it was in the car. That's what's up. I will close in my freaking vlog out. Um, so I have something to edit. But End of the saga. Sorry, I didn't do much this freaking week. I did, and I fell asleep on the live. I'm sorry, y'all. Oh, Daniel did fall asleep on the live last night. Go fuck with that Jaded Gemini's podcast intro song. You did fall asleep. I felt so bad. Doo -doo vlog bitches. Okay, so I lied. It's not over yet. We had to get some food. Yeah, this. <laughs> I don't. Did it even get your little face? Oh. We're about to pick up some food. Daniel's not wearing a tin diaper. But it's just so weird. This is like being in a restaurant. <laughs> I'm ready to freaking eat. I'm hungry as hell. Yeah, I know. I keep trying to end this vlog like fifty thousand times. Uh, we about to eat this freaking hibachi. I'm so hungry. Not even funny how hungry I am. It was like hella people at that restaurant, y'all. Y'all, please stay in the house. This virus is not over. And I know some of y'all may think like, well, bitch, you just went out and got some, some to-go food. Like, you don't know if the man cooking your food is healthy or... You get what I'm saying? And you're right. I really fucking don't. But what I can prevent is sitting somewhere and being all up in people's fucking face. Like, that's what I can fucking prevent. So, I advise y'all to do the same. I get it, some of y'all got little birthday dinners and shit, bitch. I didn't have a birthday either. Get the fuck over yourself. Like, that balloons be the cause of your fatality. Right, like, come on now. So we got us some clear, I asked for miso soup, but they gave us clear soup instead, which is okay, because that shit tastes good. Um, Y'all know I can't eat the shrimp sauce. I give these to Daniels. Here is my food. I got like mainly all vegetables. I got a full vegetable plate. I got all these carrots over here and the baby corns and the peppers and stuff like that. Um, You know, having a little vegetarian moment because they definitely, there's little bits of egg in here and I know I'm not gonna be able to pick out all the egg. But y'all know me, I'm not one of those, Um, you know, I, I have this diet for health reasons. I'm not a tree hugging person. I don't know. No offense to anybody who is vegan for those reasons. Don't get it twisted. I don't eat Alfredo and no shit like that. Like that will literally make me vomit, but I really try to uh, not, um, they could have gave me a little bit more rice. Yeah, I was about to ask for some broccoli. Mm -hmm. But like, see like big chunks like this that I could physically take out, I'll take it out because this will give me the shit. It's not gonna lie to you, but. They need to make like a three, uh, one third vegetable plate. Mm -hmm. like you can't win. That's what I got. You get vegetables and you, and you, you screw yourself over. Because mm -hmm. you end up with a whole bunch of stuff you don't even know what it is. You gotta Google it. It's hard because they be putting like the nastiest vegetables in there. Like, I don't want a zucchini. The fuck is that? So that's why I'm very picky about my vegetables um, at the Hibachi places. I learned today that this is actual corn. I did not know that this was real corn. Some type of weird vegetable that they be putting. <laughs> no, I meant like a um, Eastern vegetable. Okay, that didn't that didn't taste bad. I know y'all saw my face. That's it's not nasty. I just thought it was gonna be salty and it's sweet um carrots. That just caught me off guard. <laughs> just made the grossest face like ew. All right, let me stop picking at my food. And sit my ass down. I'm so hungry. Here, I'll put the broccoli on your face. 
Mmm. Look at that. It might be a delicioso. Goodbye, Corilla time. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs>